Hello guys, um, my name is Tempest Carter from Achievability and I wanted to talk to you today about voting. I know that usually um, we go out on our respective election days this year, June 2nd, um, and we go to our polling places, we go into the booth, we make our choice and we leave. However, in the 2020 COVID-19 pandemic, that's really not an option. There are going to be far less polling places and the polling places that are open put us in jeopardy um, and put our loved ones in jeopardy. Um, it's going to be quite difficult for us to be able to social distance. And um, so it's really best for us to all vote by mail. How do I vote for, by mail? Um, and the good news is that it's really easy and it doesn't take that much time. You can make a request to vote by mail online using your smartphone or your laptop, and you can go to www.votespa.com. You'll answer a series of questions. You will um, apply for a mail-in ballot. Um, you can do a mail-in ballot with no excuse this year. You put in your, your address, your information, in about two weeks, this shows up. This is what it looks like. And when you open it up, get this, something that looks like this. It'll have what your state representative is, what you would like to vote for for presidency, um, even delegate information and ballot questions just like you would find in a booth. You use a pen, you circle in your choice. Uh, it'll look something like this. And then you use the envelope that comes in the original package. You don't have to pay extra for any postage. You drop it in the mailbox. Applications must be um, applied for before May 26. And really, you want to do it now so that you have the opportunity to vote one time. All ballots must be in the commissioner's office and um, the county of elections by June 2nd at 8 p.m. There will be some drop-off sites, but those haven't been made public yet. Apply to vote now and put your ballot in the mail slot and you're ready to go. Once you fill out your ballot, you want to put it in the secret ballot envelope and then put it in your official envelope. So there's two steps, but once you do that, all you have to do is put it in the envelope, in the uh, mail slot, and you're done. If you need any help with filling out your ballot, please ask us at Achievability. We're here to help. Have a great day.